hi people welcome back to the channel how are you all doing my name is patricia if you're coming across to the channel for the first time so we are actually making this cough remedy when i mean cough i mean chronic cough remedy this works so fast yeah so let us get into the video but then um this is where i saved mine and so that it will last okay so keep watching and let me take you in on how i prepare this so these are the list of the ingredients that you need for this simple cough remedy this cures chronic cough like there are some stubborn coughs like <laughs> you will treat and take antibiotics it's as if the more you take the, the more they increases or the more it increases so let me just take you how you know how i use this natural remedies to cure cough both for adults and for children but for children you've got to use measurements as well as the adult as well and this remedy please it is not for children below one year old if you must give it to a child uh, below one please above 60 months okay so come in let us let me show you how i do this by the way this is a very proven uh, remedy i've used this i've tested it and it worked for me so i believe and i pray that it's gonna work for you as well yeah so and that's why i'm praying over this that as you use this product or this remedy is going to work for you in jesus name amen let us dive in So guys when you're done cleaning or peeling off the skin just go ahead and grater this i'm using this process because i find it very easy to use but you can go ahead and blend the ginger and what you when you finish this is what you're going to be seeing there is it and you what you need to do is to juice out the juice okay so i'm still on the manual uh, method yeah but uh, at the point this method wasn't helping okay and because my hands are clean of course your hand must be clean before you do this yeah very very clean so i have to use my hand to support it to get out the juice properly so um if you have any machine or juicer to do this you can use whatever you have to extract the juice from the ginger and that is what i'm what i'm doing here. So um, I was doing this method and it wasn't actually bringing out all the juice so I had to grab it and give it a very good squeeze like a very very good squeeze. So the quantity of this remedy will be based on how long you want it to stay or the quantity of the num number of people in your house so that is how you're going to be making this so it is time to juice out the lemon juice yes again you can use your lemon juice extract whatever you have but i'm using this manually to get off this so i'm using this little sieve because i don't want any drop of the seed or any pieces particles from this product okay Hence, I'm using it to, you know, to take off any particles. Yes. So, once we are done with the extracting process, see, these things you are seeing here, they are not going to be thrown away. Like, the ginger is very much useful it has a lot of flavors on it so what i would do i'll just put this in a pot put add water to it and steam it to get out the remaining juices or the remaining flavor as a juices and i'll be boiling it for 
hobby to drink so this i'll be turning this into this my little make cup yeah you can use pots whichever one that you have and i'll be steaming it a bit uh just a little bit of steaming not too much and be very careful not to over steam it you don't want to steam this too much just to boil it because um it needs to stay more than a day so this is like a preservation method that i'm using so after it has boiled for some time or steam a bit i transferred it into uh, a plate while it is still hot i'm going ahead to add two spoons of this honey please while using honey use natural honey all right use natural honey that would be more effective it works more effectively than the mistress okay so while it is hot and i'll be giving this a very good mixture um it, the 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 hotness of the liquid is going to help the um, honey to dissolve hence you want to put this when it is this hot and you give it a very very mix once you have mixed this properly storing it will not be we will not have any difficulties in storing it it will just be as this liquid yeah you will not see chunks of um honey anywhere it's going to be like this so i will allow this to cool and this is ready like it is ready to be given or to be taken and this remedy can be taken one spoon like this one spoon for adults adults can drink this for like two spoons in the morning but children give them one spoon in the morning and in the night guys this is where i put my to store it and it can be stored in the fridge and this can last for seven days yes because you boil it the boiling method is the method to preserve it more okay so it's going to last for seven days this is a medicine that works very well okay yeah so try as much as possible to keep it clean while you're making it okay you drink it as an adult and give your kids as well but please don't give it to children below one year okay as children below one year, year don't take um honey so guys if you are new to this channel and you're not subscribed to the channel what are you waiting for please go ahead and click on the subscription bell or uh, icon and turn on the bell to be notified whenever i upload a new video and i want to appreciate you all for always coming back to watch if you find this video interesting and you like it thumbs up share let someone else also see it okay as a mom of three god by the, by the grace of god god gives us wisdom and gives us ideas on how to handle some situations containing uh, pertaining to our children you know mothers are natural doctors like natural doctors we may always make a way for everything and because cough comes you know often with the weather changes so we tend to find means to cure them instead of giving them always mixed antibiotic and all that so thank you and i'm going to be seeing you in my next video stay blessed and god bless you share this video and thumbs up for your babe okay bye